Yo guys, it's Daniel, also known as Oxford Plays FIFA, the Oxford boy plays FIFA, let's get my name right. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to get the Happy Chick Multi Emulator on an iOS device. Um, it works on any iPhone, iPad or iPod Touch running iOS 9 through to 9.2.1 and 9.3. So, um, first thing I'd like you to do is to go to the App Store. Hit search, and then search for WeChat, and it's this first one here with the two speech bubbles. Um, install that, and then open it. It will ask you to create account, or you, and all you're gonna need is a phone with your phone number on it. So, because um, it, it will send the verification code to your phone. And then, um, don't worry, like, after you've got the happy check, you can just delete your account. Um, or you can keep it if you want, if anyone else has it and you want to talk to them or something. But, yeah. So, uh, first thing I want you to do once you've made your account and you're logged in, is go to the search bar. Search for Shao G Game. Hit search. Um, if it doesn't come up with this, this bit here, at the top, hit search, charge your game, moments, official accounts, etc. Then it should come up with this. So you just click it, see where it says enter official account, that should say follow. So, you come back, cancel, then you go into your contact, official accounts, charge your game. Then you go into the bit where it says iOS, tap on that, and you should receive a text. You hit that text, and then you press the three dots at the top, then hit open in Safari. It should take you to a link, you have your own personal link according to your account. So, oh god, what am I doing? What you want to do is you want to hit... Um, Step one, download for iOS. You click on that. Wait for the pop-up. Hit install. Then go to your home screen and it should be installing. Now that it's installed, click to open it. But being iOS 9, you're going to have to manually, manually allow it access. So you do that by going to settings, general. And then scroll down just underneath VPN, it will, it will either say profiles, profiles and device management, or just device management. So you click to open that, and then I believe it's Manshan. Yep, trust that. So then we can go back. So if we try and open the app, um. It crashed, just like it said it would. <laughs> Don't allow. And for some reason it's opening straight away. I don't think that's supposed to happen. Um, what should happen is that it should um, have to make you activate it. You do that by going into Safari. Oops. Uh, so you go into your history. Right, so you come to your thing. And then um, you want to copy this. And well, once you open the app, hit don't allow camera access. So you o once you open the app... In the top, um, there should be a bar, and it's asking for your activation code. So you hit, so you paste your um, activation code into that. Click activate, and then it should open. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye.